Hello my crafty friends, welcome to Origami Tree. My name is Jenny and today I'll be showing you this really cool craft. Basically you're going to be transforming old coffee cup sleeves into this magnet owl. And of course I have my owl sweater to match. To make the coffee sleeve magnet owl, of course you're going to need a coffee sleeve, a pair of regular sized scissors, a pair of craft scissors, smaller ones if you want to make finer cuts, some craft glue, some rubber bands to help with the drying time, some googly eyes, and a little magnet. First you're going to open up the coffee sleeve by peeling off the part where the adhesive is. Next I like to cut off the right and left edges, so right over here and right here. Take this larger sheet and split it into four equal parts. Next we're going to take two of these strips and roll them up with the bumpy side facing the outside. And these are going to be the little owl's eyes. When we get to the end, we're going to dab a little bit of the craft glue. Seal it off. And then secure with a rubber band. Next just go ahead and repeat the same thing with this other strip to make the other eye. Now that we're done with the owl's eyes, we're going to work on the owl's body. We're going to take the two remaining strips and using one at a time, we're going to roll it up just as we did to make the owl's eye. Once we get to the end of the first strip, we're going to glue it down and then take this last strip and place it right next to the end of the first one. Once you've glued that down, you're just going to keep rolling. Finally, you're just going to glue this last piece down. Then take your rubber band and put it around the body while it dries. While we wait for everything to dry, we're going to work on the owl's wings. So basically, I'm just going to stack these two remaining pieces together and then cut out the shape of a teardrop to make the owl's wings. And now I'm going to work on the owl's beak. And for the beak, all you really need is a small triangle. So here is my owl's beak. Then I'm going to use some remaining scrap to make the two feet. And for the two feet, I'm just going to cut out two basic triangles. And here are the owl's feet. And finally, I'm going to use some of the remaining scraps to make the two brows. And for the brows, I kind of just want to make a really elongated triangle. And here are my owl's brows. So now that we have all of the pieces made, I'm going to undo the rubber band. Next, I'm just going to glue the two eyes to the owl's body. Then I'm going to glue on the wings on both sides. Next, glue on the feet. The googly eyes the two brows, the beak, and finally the magnet at the very back. And once everything is dried, you are done. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. I post new videos all year round and I don't want you to miss them. And also to leave a comment below letting me know what type of video you'll like to see next. And until then, I'll see you soon. Bye!